Okay, give us credit, ladies, for like trying to like get y'all number, having to like get the courage to come up and talk to you, trying to figure out what to say because you know I, I talked to a few girls and you know they always talk about how they would like never come up to a dude and like talk to him like ask him out you know very few will do it but like the ones who like finally get up the courage to do it and then like they get denied or they get played or whatever <laughs> they get depressed for like weeks you know but it's like it's you know, we do that almost like every day. You know, you don't think we get like discouraged or we don't, you know, we start like getting insecure about ourselves. Like, oh, like what is it that people don't like about me? Like, what is it that women don't like about me? Like, is it my approach? Is it how I look? You know, is, am I awkward? Like, y'all got to think about it. We are, you know, it, it takes, it, it's hard for us to like see a girl that we find physically attractive and then walk up to her and be like, yo, you know, my name is blah, blah. You know, I thought you were cute, so I thought I'd come over here. Like, what's your name? Like, that's simple. And, and I think like, simplicity can help, you know, a lot with, uh, like, talking to, to women who it's, you know, kind of used to, I guess, like, dudes hollering at them or dudes, like, trying to, like, drop lines on them and shit like that. Like, I think simplicity is good, but... Please, girls, give us credit for uh, trying to come talk to y'all. Because when y'all in like a group of girls and we got to come over there and like grab the one that we want out the mix, it is extremely hard. It's extremely embarrassing. And <laughs> I was just thinking about it now, like a few months ago. Like, I mean, eh, did I get played? I, I think I got played, but she, she never like... She gave me a number, we talked one time, and then I think after that we didn't talk again. Uh, you know, I called and then I texted her. And, uh, you know, I don't go too far after. Like, the first and second time I call and text, or text two times. I usually don't go a third time, you know, unless I really, really liked you. Uh, but, like, I called her and then I texted her, and then, like, after that, like, I didn't hear anything from the call or the text. So. You know, but it took me so much courage to walk up to this girl because she was with a group of uh, with, with three other, uh, two other girls, and it was her. And like, I walked straight up to her, and you know, I acknowledged everybody. I was like, I'm, uh, I was, I'm sorry to interrupt, but it, you know, but I really, really need to talk to her. I think she was really attractive. And, like, just give me one second, and I'll let y'all get back to y'all like girls weekend. Like that's literally what I said. And you know, they thought it was funny or whatever. So, you know, I put off to the side, we talked for a bit, but I, I wanna see too much time because it obviously was, you know, they just had their little girl thing going on. So yeah, and that took a lot of courage and like most dudes won't do that and you know, they'll regret it and they'll like, you know, later on in the night, man, I should have talked to that girl. We do that shit all the time. All the time. Guys do not regret anything go for what you want whether she with three four sixteen girls unless like, the bridal ones the the ones where you know they're with the, the ladies and they're with the bride and they like having to leave them groups alone okay i mean they uh, some of them will venture off and do their own thing uh but like for the most part just leave them alone they're trying to like cater to the woman who's getting married and they don't want to take the attention away from us and most likely you're going to get denied and I'm speaking from experience because I'm out here in like uh, in Miami Beach and you see a lot of like people come out here to celebrate, you know, how they like, what do you call it, you know, parties or whatever. So leave those groups alone. You know, just go after what you want. Don't be scared. Okay, we, you know, just text them. To me. <laughs> but they, you know, go after what you want, no matter where, no matter if it's in the gym, no matter if it's your like Uber driver, you know, she's super cute, like go after what you want. Don't leave regret, you know, what you want to do. It, is, it takes a lot of courage to, get to talk to people, period, these days, especially with like, social media. It makes it even harder because people are more like, oh, like, why are you talking to me? This is weird. But just go and talk to me. Ladies, I'm, I'm not going to tell y'all no more to go talk to guys, because 
it's gonna take something else for y'all to, to do that. But you know, guys, uh, speaking from, from me to y'all, go after what you want, no matter she at work, no matter what. You know, make it short and then, you know, after that just go through text and call and you know, go out and plan dates from there. And I wanna go on a limb and say like don't ask a girl like what she wanna do. You know, you can kinda of find out what she's into and then kinda of, like put it together yourself and figure out what type of date you should have. But don't you know, rely on no don't rely on a woman to plan her own date out. You know, she kinda of wants you do that because when they're lazy, <laughs> they don't plan anything. They they want you to plan everything. So uh, no, but it's it's almost like it's it's just uh, tradition. Like you kind of just plan everything out. So you know the, the, the guys who are like you know thirty and under, please do not ask a girl. No guy ask a girl. Oh, like what do you want to do? You know, after y'all get together, because yeah, she's gonna be looking at you like you're crazy. Like, I thought you had this all figured out, you know. You know, unless she asking you on a date. But if you asking her on a date, have a plan, okay? Have something planned. Even if she don't like it, at least you have something planned, all right? So, all right, no more about that, guys. Just uh, you know, approach the ladies that you want. Don't go for with regrets. And uh, yeah, start that off today. And let me know how it worked out for y'all interested because a lot of people uh, in Miami Beach they all looking back but nobody's talking to each other everyone's like scared everybody wants to talk to everybody everybody wants to link up with everybody but nobody wants to say anything to anybody nobody wants to make that first move so uh, yeah I'm about to work out and I am going to cut my facial hair after this my beard is getting oh, shit. Oh. I'm in the gym right now people are looking at me like I'm really like what is he doing talk to me what does it say? Okay, all right, no more rambling. Uh, love my shirt. I had it on like three, three like videos. I promise my next video here in a white, in a plain white t-shirt. Okay, no more wearing this shirt. People like it. Maybe one more time.